Which is the highest selling operational main battle tanks? Is it tanks from Russia, United States, or China? Without further delay, let's check out the top 10 highest selling or most produced operational main battle tanks. Number 10. Leclerc This is a third generation French main battle tank. The Leclerc is in service with the French Army, Jordanian Army, and the United Arab Emirates Army. It has been in production since 1991 and it entered service with the French Army in 1992. The French has a total of 406 numbers, while the United Arab Emirates possesses 388. Recently, this MBT was also obtained by Jordan. The total Leclerc tank that was produced is 862 numbers. Of the units in French service, 200 will be upgraded to the Leclerc XLR standard with deliveries expected to begin soon. Number 9. The Type 99 This is a Chinese third-generation main battle tank which entered service with the Chinese army in 2001. The Type 99 MBT was China's first mass-produced third-generation main battle tank. Combining modular composite armor and tandem charge defeating ERA, 125mm smoothbore gun with ATGM capability, high mobility, digital systems, and optics, the Type 99 represents a shift towards rapid modernization by the PLA. A total of 1,200 Type 99 tanks were produced when production switched to improved Type 99G version. At number 8, the Merkava, these tanks are a series of main battle tanks used by the Israel Defense Forces. The Merkava entered official service in 1979. The Merkava was designed to provide maximum protection for its crew and therefore its front armor was fortified and the engine placed in front of the tank unlike most other tanks. Four main variants have been developed. As of 2022, Merkava Mark IV is the latest version. A total of 250 Merkava Mark I tanks, 580 Merkava Mark II, 780 Merkava Mark III tanks, and 360 Merkava Mark IV tanks were built. This gives a total of 1,970 tanks. At number 7, the Type 96. This is a Chinese main battle tank. It entered service with Chinese army in 1997. This MBT can accurately engage moving targets while it is in motion. When the tank is moving while shooting, it has a high first round hit chance against both stationary and moving targets. Some sources report that 1,000 of these tanks were built. Another 1,500 tanks were built to improve Type 96G standard, so this gives a total of 2,500 numbers. It currently serves as the backbone of China's MBT fleet. These tanks are gradually getting better. Tanzania and Sudan are this tank's only export customers. At number 6, the M1A2. This American tank is an improvement over the M1A1. Currently, it is one of the best MBTs in the world. In about 1,200 to 1,500 M1A2 main battle tanks were delivered to the US Army. Out of this number, approximately 1,000 outdated M1 main battle tanks were upgraded to the M1A2 standard. It is planned that this tank will remain in service beyond 2050. M1A2 has been exported to Saudi Arabia in quantities of about 315, 1,005 for Egypt, and 218 for Kuwait. There were 2,855 M1A2 main battle tanks constructed in total. At number 5, the M1A2 Abrams SCP. The US M1A2 System Enhancement Package SEP, is a successor to the M1A2. It is also an upgrade package for the older Abrams tanks. First upgraded tank was delivered in 1999. A total of 240 M1A2 SEP tanks were newly built. Another 300 M1A2 tanks were upgraded to M1A2 SEP standard. Furthermore, 400 oldest M1A1 tanks were upgraded to M1A2 SCP. Also, a known number of the basic refurbished M1 tanks were upgraded to this standard. So, the US military operates at least 900 main battle tanks upgraded to this standard. Total numbers built for this tank is 3,273. At number 4, the Leopard 2. This is a German third-generation German main battle tank which entered service in 1979. 
More than 2,000 of these MBTs were in service with the German army. The Leopard 2 was also a commercial success and was exported worldwide. Export operators were Netherlands, 445 tanks, Switzerland, 380 tanks, Sweden, 160 tanks, Spain, Turkey, 354 tanks, and some other countries. A number of Leopard 2 tanks were sold to other countries from German and Dutch surplus stocks. In total, 16 nations were using this tank as of now. Total tanks that were produced so far is 3,600 numbers. At number 3, T-90. This is a third-generation Russian main battle tank developed from the T-72. It entered service with the Russian army in 1992. Currently, roughly 3,728 T-90 machines with various variants have been constructed. Around 750 to 1,000 of these MBTs of all variants were built for the Russian army. Also, it is the last mass-produced MBT in Russia. The rest were exported to Algeria. 572 tanks, Azerbaijan 200 tanks, Iraq 75 tanks, Syria 40 tanks, Turkmenistan 40 tanks, Uganda 44 tanks, and Venezuela 100 tanks. Number 2. The T-80 This is a main battle tank that was designed and manufactured in the former Soviet Union and manufactured in Russia. Currently, Russia operates a total of 4,500 T-80 main battle tanks of all variants. Due to expensive maintenance, most of these tanks are in reserve. Russia there signed a contract for refurbishment and upgrade these tanks in order to keep them in operational service. Other operators of the T-80 and its variants are Belarus, 92 tanks, China, 200 tanks, Cyprus, 41 tanks, South Korea, 80 tanks, Syria, 320 tanks, Ukraine, 271 tanks, and Kazakhstan. A total of more than 5,400 numbers were built. Number 1. The M1A1 Abrams The M1A1 Abrams entered service with the U.S. Army in 1986. Currently, the U.S. Marine Corps and U.S. Army each operate little over 4,976 of these tanks. Export operators are Australia 59 tanks, Egypt 1,005 tanks, and Iraq 140 tanks. Recently, Morocco ordered 150 of these main battle tanks. Total M1A1 Abrams tank produced is 6,401 numbers.